Hello guys, what's up and welcome back to a new episode on this channel. We are animating these two screens today in Sketch and Principle and we are going to create a transition by uh, clicking this screen or basically this image right here, this movie cover and we are transitioning it over to the second screen. Now hit Principle, open up Principle and then we can simply import the Sketch file by using the import feature that our principle has right here and you see that we simply have our designs right here. Now we don't need these images right here but we can just use the screens as they are right now. Let's change the order because this is the screen that will be clicked first and we will just select the poster and drag over the arrow just to the second screen. That's creating the basic uh, screen transition. Now we want to create a transition back to the first screen so we can simply hit these, this lightning button and drag it or you can click it and click the tab. But of course to improve your workflow speed you can just click and drag to get the tab. Now we have a basic animation. Looks weird I know but we have the navigation implemented. Now let's get to the details and the first thing that we will do is to copy this inception poster to the second screen to our header image. Let's paste it right there and let's try to realign it so we get a nice uh, view. Now I change the opacity a bit to see if the images have about the same width and height. So simply try to uh, reposition it and to get the correct size of the actual image that's in the background. I think it's like around this. Let's toggle it. It's a bit bigger, but that's okay. We can even make it a little bit bigger because if I change the opacity one to 100% and we have to do something else, we have to uh, jump down and drag this below the background and description because it should of course not hide any of the elements right here. We should simply drag this down and drag the description and background above our actual header part. Now we can select the background layer and change its position to around this and we sh you see right now that we still have something of the title standing right here. We can simply change that by going back to the folder to our inception poster and we can change the size of it a little bit more and make it look better like this. Now if we trigger the animation you will see that it actually looks already kind of good but some uh, items will still fly around in a weird way but we will fix this very soon. You see that the actual part is really floating nice to the top and it's expanding in a nice way of course, if we would have a, an image with a higher quality and resolution, it would look way sharper, but you get the, the basic thing that I want to show you in this tutorial. Now you see we have this mask right here that is still flying around, so select that. It's called shape and simply add like a number or something so you have a unique name and it shouldn't fly around anymore. The arrow right here and some other icons are still changing their positions. So let's also get to this one and add some different names, some unique names. So they don't uh, change their position and fly in in this weird way. Just click it and try to do the, your best to fix the animation. We saw that we still have a weird animation 
probably the mask or the background. Some white layer is jumping down to this part. It's base. I think it's the background. So let's check if we can fix that. Yes, we have a layer that's called background right here. Just add. You can also say background two or give it any name. And you see, it's actually looking better, but the arrow and so on, these are still moving somehow. So let's try to fix this as well. I le let's go to the first uh, folder or the first screen. Maybe we should simply give this whole uh, folder a different name. And yeah, now you see we don't have this weird image floating around. But what you see is that all of the content right down here isn't really going in, in a nice way, in a fluid way. And we will fix this right now. So what we are going to do is to sec select all the layers from our first artboard and we copy them to the second artboard. Simply at the top, then you can group them up by hitting comment and group. I call this back and we will place it at the bottom. Really at the bottom. Oops. Below everything. Just drag it all the way down like this. And now it shouldn't look that weird. We still have some things left to do because this bottom description and so on looks weird how it's uh, just popping in. So we will uh, copy this bottom part which is basically everything but inception and the status bar of course. So we simply select all of this, we copy it and we paste it onto the first screen like this. What we do now is to group it up again and let's call it layer or description or anything like that and let's change the position of it. We can pull it down right here so it should actually come in nicely like this. There is still something floating around in the background, a white layer. We will look at this in a second. But you see that we already have a nice animation and transition right here. Now, as I said, something in the background is still floating around in a weird way. It's at the top, something like that. And we will just try to find it and to eliminate yeah, like eliminate the weird animation. I think it's maybe the mask that's flying around. So let's try it again. No, it's not the mask. Sometimes you just really have to get through all these layers to find the one missing thing that you like forgot or something like that. Somehow it's look it looks good. The basic animation looks brilliant, yeah, but I don't like this white element that's popping up somehow in the background. I don't know really what's the reason for this, but I will try to find it. And of course, if you find it as well, you can just write it down in the comment section. But that's the basic animation that we created in this tutorial. A very simple one, but also very important animation that you see in many apps, that you see in many great user interfaces. You click this interface, or basically this movie cover right here and it zooms in into this image and the main content is coming in from the bottom in a nice and clean way like this. But what I just saw is that the inception title and category aren't really coming up. They are just popping in as the normal content 
and we will try to find out why this is happening and I see it we don't we didn't really copy it so what you just have to do is to copy it select the layer and paste it of course let's just drag it in position it in a correct way like this and right now it should yeah it, you see it's floating in very nice okay guys I hope you enjoyed this small tutorial to animate this screen of course all the download links to the sketch file and the principal file are down in the video description if you liked it if you enjoyed it give me a thumb up or subscribe to the channel if you haven't so thank you for your time and enjoy your week See you!